Shalom, it's your brother Yarrah. Come back from another lesson. All right, through this power, spirit of Yahweh Shem Yahweh Shah, giving all praises to Yahweh Bahashem Yahweh Shah Bahashem Rachav Kadash, which is the true ancient Pele Hebrew name that the Heavenly Father and His Son, which the world today calls God and Jesus Christ. Okay, which is not His name, and also give double, double honors to the elders and apostles of the Great Millstone. Okay, and citation to the head of my camp, Zachary I teach on it in the camp of men in Israel here in Greenville, South Carolina. Entitled this lesson is Matthew chapter 21 and 43 breakdown. All right, it's not gonna be that fast. I seen uh, a lot of brothers, a lot of camps go over this, and I wanted to go over it, you know, and you just tap on it a little bit, and you know, that'd be it, man. Well, well this lesson be short. All right, this is Matthew chapter 21 and verse 43. It says, Therefore, I say unto you, the kingdom of Yahweh, the kingdom of thy power shall be taken from you and given to a nation, bringing forth the fruits thereof. All right? And what it means, it doesn't mean that uh, we're not the true Hebrew Israelites, as though the per people that's there are, are the true people. They're supposed to be in that land, which is false, man. All right, it's talking about when Israel rebelled, you know, the land was taken from us due to rebellion, man. Okay, but who is who is uh says they give it to a nation, bring them forth the fruits thereof? The Lord will never take us away from our homeland, man. So, who is he talking about? It's talking about the elect, all right, his chosen, those who who who, who follow his ways, all right, those who will keep custom to righteousness, man. All right, abiding in his truth, abiding in his wisdom, knowledge, and understanding. All right, that's what he's talking about. Okay, and we hope to be of that number, man. Okay, because when we come back to the kingdom, man, we're gonna have power, man. We're gonna be having the power of rulership. We're gonna be taking over these nations. All right, we're gonna be taking over them and, and, and putting them in captivity. All right, they're gonna be handmaids and hand service. They're gonna do it to, according to our will. All right. And they're going to build the kingdom, man. Okay? And when it's all done, we're going to kill these saw you, man. We're going to kill the, the wicked, the damn devil the Bible speaks of. But yes, man, this is uh, Matthew 19, 28. It says, And Yahweh Shah said unto them, Verily I say unto you, that ye which have followed me. All right? See that? Which have followed me. All you people who claim to love the Lord don't follow the Lord. Y'all pass is not on the highways and byways. They ain't they in temples, man. They in churches, all right, built with hands, which the Lord does not dwell upon, all right? Only thing the Lord has built with his hands was your flesh, all right? What can you build the Lord? You know, go get that chapter, man. Go get that scripture. And the Lord tells you, you know, you can't build him no house, man. You can't build him no house. Your body is your temple, man, all right? In church, all right, is a group of men who have the knowledge, wisdom, understanding that the Lord has given it to. Because his word is a mystery, man. And only his prophets that he has chosen is going to be able to reveal these things. All right, the, the prophecies, the mysteries. All right, all the things that that he speaks that is in um, parables, man. We're going to be the only ones that break it down. We're going to be the only ones who can pick, pick part, pick it to pieces and, and get precepts upon precepts, man, that... that brings everything into understanding and, and, and you know gaining wisdom from it all right so you know this is this is what you know what it means bringing a nation forth uh it says back to matthew 21 4 3 says what it says uh, and given to a nation bringing forth the fruits thereof and what fruits are they going to be man those who follow him all right Back to Matthew 19, 28, it says, continuing on, it says, In the regeneration, when the Son of Man shall sit in the throne of his glory, okay, the Son of Man, when they shall sit in, in you know, all right, when he shall sit in, in the throne of his glory, all right, when Yahweh Shah comes back, you know, we're, and during regeneration, when we come back into the kingdom, all right, we, he's going to be there, you know what I'm saying? He's going to be there when we, you know, and our new bodies and everything, man. When the two thirds have has came back from their destruction, from being wicked, all right, we're gonna be ruling, man. We're gonna be, we're gonna be with the heavenly, uh, with with His Son, okay. 
And it says, ye also shall sit upon 12 thrones, judging the 12 tribes of Israel. All right. Talking about the elect. The elect is going to judge 12 tribes of Israel. All right. This is Romans 9 and 6 says, not as though the word of Yahweh have taken none effect for they that are all Israel, which says, for they are not all Israel, which are of Israel. All right. And what does that mean? Okay. Yeah, we have the land. That, uh, we had our land. And we and the Lord has scattered us abroad four corners of the earth, all right, through our wickedness, man. Okay, and the wicked have, has taken took him, took him, uh, himself there and and st stolen our land and made himself to 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 be an apostle, calling themselves Jews, calling themselves the true Jews and the men of the Lord, and they're not, all right, because we're not supposed to return to our land until the heavenly Father gets back, you know, until he until the heavenly. Uh, so our, our Lord and Savior, how about me? Our shot comes to re, to redeem the, uh, his 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 kingdom, all right. Taking the wicked out of his chair, all right, which is Esau, Edom. We ain't supposed to be in our whole, in our land right now. The wicked's in our land. That goes back to Revelations, man. All right, it says for those who call themselves Jews or the, or, or or not the true Jews, but uh, the synagogue of Satan, roughly paraphrasing. Okay. And this is this is the thing of the confusion of Esau, man. He's a he's a deceiver of all things. This man, this man sits and have all our brothers and sisters, you know, you know, which 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 believes that they are they are Christians, or whatever, you know, who believes in Christianity, they believe that they are the true people over there, but they don't believe that they themselves are, you know, the so-called black Spanish Native Indians. They don't believe that they themselves are, which is are the true. Hebrew Israelites, the Bible speaks of, and this is this is what 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 what's, what's taking us so far alone to come back home because our people wants to be simple, all right? They want to be prudent to knowledge, man. They don't they don't want to understand anything. The only thing they want to understand is their belly, food, sex, and getting high or sitting on their ass and going back to work, thinking that they're, you know, this is the life they're supposed to be living, and it's not. We're not supposed to lift a fucking finger, man. We're supposed to tell somebody what to do and bring it to us. And have no ifs and buts about it, but Jake wants Jake want to be a servant the rest of his fucking life. All right, but that's not that's that's the the Israelites of the flesh, those who who wants to be of the world, those who who love the things, the wickedness in the earth. All right, those are those are they of our bloodline. Yep, but they're not of the spirit of the heavenly Father, so they're not the true Israelites. All right, they're not they're not going they're not part of the elect. They are they're part of. They part of the, the pit, man. They part of the uh, the pit of the, of, of the bowl of, of lake of fire, man, which is gonna be burned in brimstone, all right? Because they choose not to go back to the heavenly father. They choose the world. They chose the things of of this life instead of choosing the things of the heavenly father, which is in the spirit, man. Okay. So that that's the breakdown of that. And this is Romans uh, nine and seven it says neither because they are the seed of Abraham. Uh, it says are they called children? Neither because they are the seed of Abraham are they all called children, but in Isaac shall that seed be called. It says in Romans 9 and 8, that is which are the children of the flesh. These are not the children of Yahweh, which I just said. It says, but the children of the promise are counted for the seed. And who are the children of the promise, man? Those who are going to inherit the kingdom. Those who, those who what? Who follow him. Okay. There are going to be those the Lord have chosen who rising up. Who call on the true uh, names of the heavenly Father Yahweh, and, and his son's name Yahweh Shah Hamashiach? All right, they're they're going to be called upon. They're going to be the, the chosen ones. All right, they're going to be choosing of the heavenly Father. All right, they're going to be the, the 144 elect. Okay, who receive who receive the crown of life and and going to rule over the twelve tribes of Israel. Okay, and it says continuing on Romans nine and eight says that that is. They which are the children of the flesh, these are not the children of Yahweh, but the children of the promise are counted for the seed. All right, which is all, what, what what all this mean all together, which is what the Israelites, I mean the, the elect, is those who bring for, who brings forth the fruits. Okay, which is gonna be that new that, that nation that comes back to our land, and it's all gonna still be Israelites. You know, that's not saying you know that anybody. That 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 are that we're not we're, that we don't belong in our land that you know the Lord has taken us away from it and we're not supposed to come back. That's bullshit, man. 
So anybody who's who's making that claim, they can go to hell with that shit. You know? As in speaking, you can go to judgment, man. You know, we know we know that's not what that hell is not what that really means, but I say it anyway just because. So this is Romans nine and one says I say the truth in Yahweh Shah, I lie not. My conscience also bearing me witness to and the Holy Spirit that I have great heaviness and continually yearly saw verily sorrow in my heart. For I could wish that myself were a, a, a cure a curse from Yahweh Shah for my brethren, my kinsmen according to the flesh, who are Israelites to whom pertaineth the adoption, and the glory, and the covenants. And given of the law, and the servants of Yahweh, and the promises, which goes to back what? That clarifies what? Romans 9 and 8. Okay? And it says in Romans 9 and 5, Who are the fathers, and of whom, as concerning the flesh, Yahweh shall came, who is all who is over all, Yahweh blessed forever. Amen. For finding fault with them, he said, Behold, the days come, says the Lord, when I will make a new covenant with the house of Israel and the house of Judah. All right. So which does that tell you what? The Lord is not done with Israel. He's not done with his people. He's not done. All right. It belongs to us. The land of Israel belongs to us. So-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans, and Native Americans, yes. All right. Belongs to us. Okay. Not anyone else. There's no convert. There's no you other other you other nations cannot convert into this truth. This Bible does not belong to you. It doesn't belong to you. It it, it isn't. It has nothing to do with you. The law was not given to you. The law was only given to the the, the so-called black Hispanics and Native Americans, man. Why are y'all continue to to take to take our Bible and and feed our people bullshit with your with your with your greedy ass bellies, man? Telling them to tie up to you and and have hope in nothing. Okay, why you go spend their money to live your luxury lives? This is the demonizing shit that Esau has created for so that all the other heathen ass nations can can still be on top of Jake, man, and oppress Jake. Jake going there with, with shitty clothes on, shitty shoes on, old ass, you know, old ass gear. Meanwhile, you know, looking for the Lord and still not gonna find him because he's going in the wrong places, man. The prophets on the highways and byways. All right, you need to come back into the law, statutes, commandments, man. And know that you're the true Hebrew Israelites, the Bible speaks so uh, And repent from your wrongdoings, man. And seek the Heavenly Father the best way you can. And with that, man, I'm going to end it. The kingdom belongs to the Hebrew Israelites. All right, the elect. And with that, shall we